was born blind, actually. Uh, I didn't open my eyes at all. Chidima Ekile, born 2nd May 1991, recently disclosed to the public that she was born blind. Welcome to Top News Splash. If you are new to this channel, please hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any updates about Nigerian and African celebrities. I didn't open my eyes at all. And um, of course, that, that, became, that became a challenge. Uh, my parents, I mean, tried all that they could to get this baby to see. Um, everything they tried medically proved abortive and um, we had to resort to God, you know. Um, so here is my mom. Um. Chidima is a Nigerian singer, songwriter and actress hailed from Imo State, Nigeria. She became a public figure in 2010 after winning the third edition of Project Fame West Africa. Chidima became the first female musician to peak at the number one on the MTV Best Official Niger Top 10 chart. This came after the release of her Amy Nibala single music video. After then, Chidima released a lot of hit track. Then on first May 2021, Chidima shocked the whole world. She announced via her Instagram page that she is changing from secular music to gospel music. After making the announcement, she hit the ground running with the release of her single, Jehovah Overdue. There is nothing you cannot do, Jehovah Overdue. In a seven-minute video shared on her YouTube channel, Chidima disclosed why she abandoned secular music. She opened up about her childhood and how her mother made a deal with God. Back to God, <laughs> you know if God could help her solve um, that problem. Yeah, so that was where, I mean, that's where church comes in, you know. So she started taking me to church. Um, I was going to church with her, like, every time. And um, it, became, it became a tradition for, for myself and my mom. The former secular singer disclosed she was born blind and her parents had to turn to God after medical efforts could not help. Quoting Chidima, I was born blind actually. I did not open my eyes at all, and that became a challenge. My parents tried all that they could to get me to see, but all medical efforts proved abortive. According to the talented singer, her parents eventually turned to God for her healing, which was a miracle. And that was the time that her mother entered into an agreement with God. According to her, her mom reached an agreement with God to dedicate her to him. She said, without my knowledge, my mom made a deal with God. So, without my knowledge, um, my mom apparently um, made a deal with God. You know, you know how people just go into covenants. You know, without telling the person, <laughs> you know, and I mean, it was her just um, having a deal with God, you know, like yeah, if you do this for me, I'll do that for you, you know. So yeah, I, put, I, I opened my eyes and she took me back to church, and I feel like. And Jesus from me, He has opened up the door. So obviously, I, I am a covenant child, maybe. I've not been able to optimally to function to my fullest potential um, outside of God. Um, I feel like, you know, God is my source and there is no way that I would be able to, to do anything outside of him. Like he has to be in the equation. So maybe you're out there and you're just like me. Or maybe you're just like how I used to be. And um, maybe you've tried everything. You've 
tried all, all other options, but nothing seems to work. Trust me, the moment you find your way back to your source, everything will begin to make sense. Speaking on why she abandoned secular music, Chidima said she felt empty and was looking for fulfillment. According to her, I was looking for my fulfillment, but I could not find it until I reconnected with my source. But there was still that emptiness that I felt. I was looking for that fulfillment, you know. I didn't find it until I found my source, until I got reconnected back to my source. And Chidima began singing at the age of six. When she was 10 years old, she joined her church choir. She resided in Ketu, Lagos State, while attending a primary and secondary school before relocating to Ikorodu with her family. Before winning the project firm West Africa, we shoot her to limelight. She initially worked as a business promoter in Lagos State. After winning the project firm, Chidima decided to dye her hair red and getting a mahawk. People started seeing her as a good girl gone bad. In an interview, she said she is still the same person and is evolving and growing musically. After years of secular music, Chidima is now a renowned born again and a minister of the gospel. And she recently shared a story of how she was miraculously healed of her blindness. Glory be to God. Thanks for watching guys and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more latest updates about Nigerian and African celebrities. Thank you.